Seven of Swords and Two of Wands. So this could be someone that's at a Seven of Swords. They're trying to strategize how can they prolong something or keep something at a stalemate. <clears throat> Maybe they're at a stalemate, you know, after being at the Seven of Swords, sneaky and deceptive behind the scenes. Yeah, they're trying to strategize something. But it's like this person on this two of wands, it's something coming, but they don't know. It's like they're waiting at a stalemate. And they don't know that this person, somebody is at the seven of swords, like coming towards them. So it's like if this person was someone that always did stuff at the seven of swords, very sneaky and deceptive, they thought they were calculated. <clears throat> And they will always like think that they were smarter than people. And um, they will sit there and act like they didn't know what was going on. It's like this energy is coming back to them or it's around them. Yeah, five of wands and four of cups. This is somebody that's conflicted. They got rejected and it's like they're going through a lot of conflict or they want to cause some type of conflict because they got rejected by somebody. And um, they feel insecure. And it's like, as this person, you know, feel like they got rejected. They feel insecure. Instead of trying to heal their self, they like to try to project their energy off onto other people. This is somebody that's just trifling. They're not happy with their self, so they don't want other people to be happy. And this could be somebody that was secretly, like, trying to compete with you because somebody rejected them. Something like that. Yeah, page of cups in the reverse. Yeah, they, this person was admiring them. They wanted this person to possibly admire them or they wanted people to secretly admire them. And they, um, this could have been somebody that was admiring you and they weren't admiring that person. It's like they secretly slipped at the five or one. It's like this person know better. That's why they're always trying to do different stuff behind the scenes. They know better too. It's like this person know, know better than try to bring conflict to you or try to come up to you this person has to be sneaky it's like you have more control over this person than they have over their self and they don't get that yeah six of swords is here this is somebody that you don't even know you're not around this person this could be a person that's at a distance from you Somebody could have distanced their self from this person. And they're, you know, at the five of wands secretly. They got rejected. Or something like that. These are people that you don't even care about. You know, you're not even attached to. It is not your fault that they got rejected. You're not even attached to the person that rejected their ass. <laughs> Knight of Cups is here. Yeah. This is somebody that could feel rejected by you as well. They want to connect with you and things like that, and they feel rejected. You could have rejected this person, or they just feel insecure. And they're secretly trying to take it off onto you. Or something like that. One of the two. Yeah, Justice is here. And then Three of Cups. And four of pentacles. So it's like somebody could have been um, trying to control a situation. Hold on to something too tight. And um, justice is being served for whatever was going on behind the scenes. And it's like as justice is being served. These are people that's used to being at the uh, seven of swords. Very sneaky, deceptive. You know, trying to keep things at a standstill. Trying to, you know, cause conflict and keep chaos going on. They're not going to see this coming. At all. They're sitting back trying to have control over something that they don't even, you know, can't control. These are people that can't even control their self. It's like you have more control over these people than what you know. And these are people that you don't even know. They don't see it that way, though. 
Ace of Cups is here. And then a devil in the reverse. Yeah, you chose to start loving yourself and um, finally taking care of yourself. You're someone that takes care of yourself. And um, you don't have any, any ties to the devil. It's like you don't have any addictions, obsessions, any toxicities or anything. So it's like they could not have you at a standstill or be at the Seven of Swords or strategize against you. They didn't know they were, you know, doing it to their self. They couldn't even send any negative energy around you. It's like the more and more they try to do different stuff, it come back. Five of Wands is here. That conflict, you know, they get hit with that. It's sad. Yeah, the cherry in reverse, and they can't move forward. It's like th the plan was for them to sit back and be sneaky and deceptive behind the scenes so you wouldn't move forward. They're not realizing that they did all of this to their self and not you. You're not someone that's toxic. You're not someone that will intentionally try to do stuff so this person could move forward. You're not someone that sit back and intentionally lie and cheat and steal and do different ill will stuff to people to cause conflict to them. So it didn't hit you. It hit them and the people that are attached to these people or this person. That's it. That's why justice is being served for you. People don't realize that it's, you know, the universe that we, you know, are in, it's energy. It goes off of energy base. A lot of people are confused. And um, they're like stuck in a matrix. They don't understand. They're so used to the same concepts, the same thought patterns, and they're confused. And they don't get the stuff that they do to people in a negative way. It just comes back on them and the people that they're attached to. So they could have been used to doing stuff to people that were very negative, very toxic. And um, it wouldn't come back on them that bad. But it's like immediately as they do stuff to you, it immediately just come right back. Everything is rejected. Four of Cups is here. That's why they're going through so much conflict. And they feel rejected because the stuff that they're trying to secretly throw at you is being rejected. These are people that rejected God a long time ago. These are people that rejected their soul. And that's the truth, Ace of Swords, clarity. And these are people that sit back and they sit at the five of ones with you. They want to be you. They want your soul, but they rejected their own. This is sad. Queen of Pentacles is here. Yeah, you're someone that works very hard, Queen of Pentacles. Someone that's very stable, very grounded, very money oriented, business oriented. Very stable with your finances and um you could have multiple businesses as well. You know, different ways that you manifest money in abundance. And um, a lot of people are intimidated by that, but you work hard to get where you at. The Hermit card is here. Yeah. You're someone that's always in Hermit mode. And you work hard. People could have thought that you would be in hermit mode, you know, that people had to ghost at you, or you, I'm getting you always been the type that don't even be around people like that. A lot of people like that, you know, like to be around you, like to talk to you, but it was like you weren't around a lot of people like that. This have always been you. A lot of people possibly, you know, that like to talk to you and want to be around you. They didn't understand why they didn't, why you didn't want to go out or why you didn't want to be around them or why you didn't want to be on the scene and. Things like that. So yeah, you're someone that works hard and it's like you get the job done by yourself. You had to, this person that's at the hermit, you're an old soul. You had to went through a lot, so you know a lot. And it's like um, you know enough to know that things are going to get done if you do it. And that's just how people, some people are. Some people, you know, they need help. 
but it's like certain stuff the way the way i'm getting this energy is that you were someone that always helped a lot of people you know this queen of pentacles is someone that's very nurturing very loving very giving very kind and it was like you were doing all of this for everybody else but not for yourself when you went ghost harmony mode you became this queen of pentacles for yourself because you were working hard for everyone else and then you started go you know you went within to investigate yourself started getting enlightened started healing started cleansing recharging your energy regaining your strength so you could work on yourself yeah the lovers is here and then judgment is here Yeah, this person, whoever this person is that, um, this lover's card, it talks about like a deep soul connection with someone. This person have made a final decision that they want to, um, you know, connect with you. This person is in love with you. You have a deep connection with this person. And they might, you know, with this judgment card and then the lovers, they've made like a final decision. Yeah, this person could want to elope with you with this hermit card and queen of pentacles. Yeah. Nine of Cups is here. Yeah, this person sees you as their wish fulfillment. Nine of Cups. You make this person happy. And then Six of Pentacles is here. Yeah, they look at you as their equal. Equal give and take. They know you're someone that's um equal, honest. They know that you're someone that they can be equal with. And then the strength card is here. And look at you as someone that's very strong. It's like <clears throat> your strength bring courage to other people. How strong you are. And you had to went through a lot. Because some of the stuff you had not went through, it could have, you know, it would have killed other people. It would have tore them down. It would have had them in the chariot in the reverse where people wanted you. But these people didn't even know who you were. Didn't know what you had them went through. You're someone that's very strong. You had them went through a lot and you came out on top. You give this person strength. Knight of Wands is here. And then Three of Swords. Yeah, somebody could be on the run. Three of Swords and Knight of Wands. This is like fleeing the scene. Depression. Heartache. Somebody could be heartbroken about something. Unknown and Page of Swords. This is somebody that was at the Knight of Wands doing a whole bunch of stuff without thinking. And this is somebody that was watching you, stalking you, observing you. Somebody that you don't even know. They're sitting back in the Three of Swords heart, bro. They could have tried to place some type of Knight of Wands energy onto you. And now they're in that Knight of Wands energy. This person cannot stop watching you. This is somebody that you don't even know. That sat back and thought they were going to place this lustful energy onto you. They ran in quick. Somebody could have came in on this energy on them. They had them doing stuff without thinking. And they're sitting back depressed, heartbroken, stressed out. Can't stop watching you. Spying on you. Over the internet. Observing you. And this is somebody you don't even know. Ten of Pentacles is here. Yeah, they're heartbroken because you're in this Ten of Pentacles. You have a Ten of Pentacles generational wealth. You're someone that chose yourself. You didn't chose to get behind the scenes and try to rile up people or be sneaky and deceptive because you felt rejected or insecure. You started working on yourself, building on yourself. And you went in hermit mode, went within to investigate yourself. Started loving yourself. It's like you chose yourself. It's like if this person would have minded their business, they wouldn't be at the Three of Swords heart, bro. 
This person is in a knight of wands energy, lustful energy, just doing stuff without thinking. And this person could have did this all because somebody rejected sex from them. And they were at the three of swords heartbroken because this person didn't want, you know, they felt like that was the only thing that they had to offer this person. And they got mad when this person rejected them and took it out on you because this person was secretly admiring you and in love with you. Something that you didn't even know. This was a secret. But they came and tried to take it out on you. Secretly. Yeah, the hair fighting the reverse. Seven of cups and then the world is here. It's like, this was somebody that they could not trust. The hair fighting the reverse. This is someone that's not trustworthy. This is someone that's, um, you know, they don't commit. It's like they, they're not someone that'll stay in a committed relationship. And they didn't want this person to be in a commitment with you. Like, if this person came towards you to express the way they felt, this is what they were fearing. So it's like, this is someone that did not, you know, they didn't get this person to commit to them. And they didn't want this person to commit to you. And that's the only reason why this person did commit to them. Because they were too busy worried about stuff that they shouldn't have been worried about. And they confused their self. Seven of Cups in the world is here. They thought they were confusing this person. Placed them in illusion confusion because a cycle was, you know, been, been overdue to be completed. A toxic karmic cycle that this person didn't even know they were in with that person. And they thought they would confuse that person. Yeah. This is somebody you don't even know. They're sitting back hard, bro, because their lustful energy did not work. Two of Swords is here. They thought they had them placed blindfolds on a lot of people's eyes around them on this person. And this person was somebody that, you know, they just weren't saying anything. So they thought they had this person confused. This person was not confused. This person is in love with you. Yeah, King of Swords is here. <clears throat> yeah, this person's at the King of Swords. But then it's somebody that they cut off. And then Eight of Swords. Yeah. Wow. Somebody could be blinded to the fact that a, a police officer is watching them. Because I don't know why this King of Swords and Eight of Swords, that's like getting picked up to go to jail. This is somebody in the justice system. This person could be getting watched. Whoever this energy is that was at the Knight of Wands doing a lot of stuff without thinking. And as they were at the Seven of Swords being sneaky and deceptive with you and doing a whole bunch of stuff to try to prolong this or do this and that, they were blinded from the truth. <clears throat> These People that are at the Seven of Swords, they think that they're, you know, smarter than other people. They think they can strategize and this and that. And <clears throat> they didn't know that it was a King of Swords like investigating or somebody was watching them. Like, whoever this person is that's at the Seven of Swords, they don't know that they've been caught. Eight of Swords and King of Swords and then Two of Swords. That's the King of Swords and then the Ten of Swords. That's like being pent down at the Ten of Swords. This person could have some type of time. Because Ten of Swords is like prison time. Doing hard time. And this person is blinded to the truth and they don't know. They're just sitting back watching you. And this is somebody you don't even know. Too busy worried about your life and not their own. Yeah. Knight of Swords in the reverse. Yeah, this is sad. This person is upset because whatever they came, they, they, they couldn't get people to be mad at you. They couldn't rile up people to be hate, hating on you or jealous of you. It's like they couldn't do any of that. This is somebody that can't even, this, this person jumped in quick to be mad at you because somebody else rejected them, could no longer have sex with them. They could no longer use this lustful energy that they thought they would get everybody with. And it didn't work. This is somebody that did not know their self-worth and they would just lay down with anybody and they thought that this, that this was love. This is sad. I'm not, I'm going to go, I'm going from that. This is somebody that's sad. This is somebody that's mad because you're not bitter and you're not angry. They couldn't upset you. This was somebody that was 
a non-factor in your life. That's why they had to be behind us. It's like you had control over them and they had none over you. And they don't get that. And it's like, you don't even know this person to, you know, just to say, because normally people will say they have control over things that they, you know, people that they know, people that they're attached to in a positive way. You don't even know that you have control over this person. And they're obsessed over you. And watching you and stalking you. And heart broke because they could not come in at the night of wands for somebody that was, you know, in love with you. This is sad. It's like this person need to heal. They don't know their self-worth and got mad because you love yourself and you do. And try to secretly take it out on you. How dare you love yourself? How dare you not just lay down and have sex with anybody? How dare the lies and slander don't, you know, did not work that they spread it on you? All because they got rejected and they wanted people to be blinded from the truth. Wanted you to feel insecure. And you didn't feel insecure or rejected by nobody because you know your worth. These people that thought that they had to reject you or isolated you, these are people that had took losses as they weren't attached to you. Being attached to different energies, you know, that want to project negative energy off onto them is the reason why they took losses. You weren't in that energy. So it couldn't be projected off onto you. Yeah, the death card is here. Wow. And then seven of pentacles. Somebody had them paid. Yeah. This person is getting ready to go to jail. They had them gave somebody, you know, some money, like invested or gave somebody some money to do a murder, to plan somebody's actual death. And they don't know they're getting ready to go to jail. They could have been sitting back trying to plan your death. And this is something you don't even know. You were being watched because somebody went to the police and exposed this person and they don't know. They could still be thinking that they're working with this person. And they don't know this person had to turn them in. And it's a full-fledged investigation that had been going on. Yeah. High Priestess is here. Yeah, it's hidden. As I say, you at the Seven of Swords doing a whole bunch of stuff behind the scenes and you don't know what's hidden. These are people that set back. You're, in, you're this High Priestess. You're someone that knows, you know, you know the truth about people. You speak the truth about people and you knew their secrets. Someone that's very gifted. Very intuitive. Very talented. And this person wanted, you know, wanted you out of here because they could not be you. They figured if you be out of here, this person was going to lay down with them and have sex with them. Just sad and sick. This person had done brought this on their self. Yeah, they, this person don't know that you're protected. This is divine protectance with this temperance card being here. This is sad. Yeah, and then King of Wands is here. Yeah, so it's like whoever this person, it's a lot of people involved. And um, somebody could have been following you around, pouring stuff in your drinks because they wanted you to be attracted to them with this temperance card. And King of Wands also is what I'm getting. So it's like they're caught up with this person. And it's like this person don't even know. It's like if this person was paying this person to do different stuff, they're caught up. With this person. Just sad. They possibly thought that they couldn't get in trouble for um, whatever they were doing in a sneaky, deceptive way. They ended up getting exposed. The person can't be mad at nobody but their self. Knight of Swords in the reverse. Like this person just brought a lot of conflict to their self and they didn't know. Everything that they wanted to send at you, it was rejected. Four of Cups is here. Five of Wands. Eight of Cups and King of Pentacles. So it's like somebody ended up walking away from a confused mindset as they were sitting back watching you. Could have been multiple people. Eight of Wands is here. 
you definitely do something online where people watch you. Yeah, I'm just getting ready to say that. You have a platform, six of wands and eight of wands. That's like having a platform. You, you know, people, you're like a messenger. You give messages to people. And um, a lot of people look up to you. They have respect for you, six of wands. They hold you in high honor for whatever it is that you do. You had to help a lot of people walk away from a confused mindset. Stuff that they didn't plan on doing and they never knew. Yeah, the sun card is here. A lot of stuff came to light and a lot of secrets have been revealed and exposed. King of Cups. Yeah. It's like you had to open up this person's heart chakra. Whoever this person is that's in love with you. They were no longer at the page of cups. That's why that's in the reverse as well. They weren't admiring, you know, you anymore. This person was in love with you. Page of cups in the reverse and then ace of cups. As this person thought they were going to cause a lot of conflict and this person wouldn't admire you anymore. This person fell in love with you and they opened up their heart chakra. Watching you. Or something like that. Whatever it is that you do online. 